Hey guys, I'm Julia and welcome back to your second workout of week two. So this is again the same format, we're sticking to those four Tabata blocks. This workout though is going to be a little more focused on upper body and core, again incorporating those plyometrics and that cardio. 20 seconds on, 10 seconds rest. You with me? So let's go, we're going to warm up a little bit and we'll get started. All right, so lots of arms. We're just gonna do some windmill circles backwards. Good, shoulders down, nice long straight arms. Not moving your lower body a lot, keeping your core tight to control your arms and just reverse the direction. Nice job. Nice, shake them out a little bit. Good, so we're just gonna do a little knee and then a punch. So nice and quick, knee, step, punch. Pull your knee in and punch. Up and down and punch, four more, four, and punch. Here's three, and two, one more, and one. Nice job, other side. So switch over, a knee, and a punch. Up, and hit. Breathing out when you crunch, and hit. Four more, four, three, two, one more, and one. Good, just take it slow. We're just gonna do a few taps to the sides, just for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Give me one deep breath. Exhale, shake it down. You ready? So upper body here. We're gonna start on the floor. I'm gonna show you the first two exercises of this first block, then we'll get started. So you're gonna start in your plank onto your elbows, palms down. So we're still a little bit at the beginning here, amping it up from last week, but if you can, come up off of your knees, but knees are no problem too. Roller coaster planks. You're gonna lean to one side, push yourself up, come back down. One side, up and down. So leaning to the same side every time, we'll switch when we go to the next set. Yeah, so the next part, our cardio plyo, is an X jump and a burpee. We're gonna start with a burpee actually. So we're gonna go burpee, X jump. If you need to, just take it to X jack. Those are the first two. 20 on, 10 off. You ready? Let's get into that plank and get going. Ready, set, and go. So lean to one side, up, up, down, down. Roller coaster planks. Keep your hands in the same place. You're gonna lean to one side. Again, this is what it looks like if your knees are off the floor. Lean, come up, back down. Working your shoulders, triceps, Four, three, two, and one. Nice job, shake those arms out. Ready for those that cardio, the plyo, X burpee, X jump. I'm gonna go sideways, you can see my feet go out. Ready, go. So my feet go X out, X out again. One, two, one, two. Out in, your option is to land instead of jump. Keep breathing, X out, X up. X out, nice job. One more, and down. Good job, shake it out. That's two, take it back down to the ground. So you're gonna lead the other direction. Get ready, four, three, two, one. Lead in the other direction, up, up, down, down. Up, up, down, down. If you're off your knees, looks like this. Maybe you'll do a little combo, up as long as you can. Remember, Tabata is intense as much as you can. Down, down, up, up, four, three, two, and one. Nice job. Ready for those X jack, X burpees? Now that you know the way to do it, I'm gonna face you and do it. Ready? Go. X out, X up, out. And again, here's your option. But keep it moving, keep it active, take it to your high intensity. Everyone is different, it's often different day to day. Keep going, five seconds, four, three, two, and one. Excellent, so that was two down. We have six rounds left, you ready? Back down to those roller coaster planks. Four, three, two, and one. Lean the other direction, the first direction. This is round five. Up, up, down, down. Make sure you don't let your shoulders crunch into your neck. Strong shoulders, belly tight. Lean to one direction and drop it. Nice job, feeling it in my shoulders. Triceps, four seconds, three, two, and one. Whew. Excellent, take it up. 
X, X, X burpee, X jump. Ready? Four, three, two. Let's do it. X out and out. Feet go out, they come in, out and in. Out, in, or right here. Keep going, y'all. So close. One more. And out, in. Good job. Back down. One more each. Shake it out. Breathe. A little drink of water is okay. If you can do it in four seconds. Three, two, and go. The other direction this time. Up, up, down, down. Good job. Again, if you come down to your, up to your knees, you go up, up. A little more challenging, putting a little more body weight on your arms, but it's Tabata. You can do it. Five seconds, four, three, two, and one. Excellent. One more X burpee, X jump, then we're on to round two. Keep breathing. We got five, four, three, two, let's go. Out in, out in. Nice job. Remember to land soft, bend as you land. You don't want to land and then bend, keep it fluid. Keep going, keep moving. Four, three, two, and one. Excellent. Block two, let me show you the moves. We'll get started. Another plank. So you're gonna come down, start in your plank. So your feet are gonna stay in the same place. Your arms are gonna walk in a half circle. You're gonna walk over here and bring it back. Walk it over to the other side. Back and forth, working those shoulders. Hitch hops is your cardio move. One leg at a time, you're gonna step back and do a little hitch hop, back, hitch hop. All on one leg, we'll switch over to the other side the next round. You ready? Here we go. Coming back to those plank walks for four, three, two, and one. So keep your feet in the same place. You wanna move quick, but you also wanna make sure you're doing it right. Shoulders away from your ears, don't let them crunch up, push away from the floor. Feet stay together, same place. If you need to, hold your plank. You have four, three, two, one. Whew. Excellent, shake your arms out. We're working those, huh? Ready for those hitch hops. Pick a leg to go first in three, two, one. So you're gonna go down and a little hop. Tap down, a little hop. Let me show you from the side a little bit. Tap down, kick hop, and hop. Good. Tap and tap, hop. Five, four, three, two, one. Awesome. That's two down. Take it back down. We're gonna walk in a half circle in that plank. You ready? For four, three, two, and one. Up. So this is a toughie. If you need to modify, you can either hold your plank or just go from your knees. This way you're still moving, but you don't have as much weight carried on your arms. Otherwise, you're up here. Four seconds. Three, two, and one. Amazing. Up, 10 second break. We're gonna do those hitch hops. Make sure you have the other foot going back, the other foot kicking this time. Ready? Three, two, let's go. Tap and hop. Tap, hop. Back and forth. One foot takes the place of the other foot. Hop, hop. Down and kick. And breathe. Down and up. Four, three, two, uh, one. Halfway through this one. Back to the floor. Half circle plank walks. Four seconds. Three, two, and one. Take it up. Walk. Feet stay together. Keep lifting through your belly. Keep your shoulders strong. Again, modify on your knees or by holding a plank. Keep going. Five seconds. Four, three, two, and one. Nice job. Take it up. So the same leg you did the first set on, one more time. You ready? Four seconds. Three, two, and one. Tap 
and kick and kick tap and kick putting one foot where the other one was adding more of a hop for more intensity or more of a step for a little less whatever your intensity level is take it there the highest you can do just 20 seconds two more one more and amazing one more round you guys are doing so good down to your knees toes whatever you got to do keep it going four seconds to rest three two let's go lifting through your belly walk take your time the intensity comes from the move on this one it's not about speed side to side belly tight walk it five seconds four three two one awesome one more exercise hitch hops the other side take your time breathe don't take your time actually time is out one more set let's go tap and kick and kick back and forth a little more hop for more intensity down kick you guys are doing great five seconds four three two and one amazing breathe you got about a 20 second break while i show you the third block you're going to grab your weights for this one so one or two weights your feet are wide you're going to reach to the center shuffle as you row up shuffle as you row down the outside leg comes in the outside leg comes back one or two weights on that whatever you got to do the cardio move three moguls feet together ski 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 of course a burpee out in back up you got it so grab those weights one or two feet wide slightly turned out the other hand can be on your hip 20 seconds let's go reach shuffle reach up keep moving keep breathing combining that resistance training with cardio hitting those calories burning them double hard keep breathing four three two and one great job weights down 10 second recovery three moguls and a burpee you ready three two feet together little ski hops moguls one two three out in up one two three good job bending your knees as you land and up one more time out in and up great job Whew. other hand make sure you remember which arm you use you're switching it over four seconds to rest three two here we go reach pull step outside leg comes in outside leg comes in reach coming down with a flat back keep moving five seconds four three two and one excellent weights down three moguls and a burpee breathe five seconds four three two let's go mogul 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 and burpee side 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 landing soft taking it a little deeper five seconds four three two finish this one out one great halfway through grab those weights again one more time on the other side three two let's hit it reach pull so if you're having a hard time keeping that shuffle with this resistance move you can keep your feet in place maybe just pick up the speed of your lift to keep those calories burning give me four seconds three two and one great job 10 second recovery you know what's coming moguls burpee three two let's go you're doing so great 
you need a modification for this one, maybe instead of jumping with two steps, you go one, two, finish this burpee, and up. Excellent. Grab those weights. Woo. One more round of each. Doing such a great job. Feet wide. Here we go. Reach and pull. Up. Again, an option would be to keep your feet wide, up and down, maybe pick up the speed. If you can't get your feet moving at the same time, that's all right, you can work up to that. Five seconds. Four, three, two, and one. Weights down. One more exercise of this round. Whew, five more seconds to recover. Three, two, let's go. Mogul, like your skin. And down, burpee, take a mogul, side, side, and over. One more, two, three, and up. Awesome job. Quick breath, quick drink. We have one more block left. Let me give you, let me grab a, grab a weight, take your feet wide. I'm gonna call these infinity swings. You're gonna make an infinity sign or a sideways eight. Right here, nice and low, side to side. Using your torso to control. Second exercise, gorilla shuffles. Staying in a nice low crunch. One, two, one, two. Like you're a gorilla. Yeah? One, two, one, two. Ready? This is the last one. One weight, two weights, whatever feels good, whatever takes you to your highest intensity. Ready? Here we go. 20 seconds. So you're making a sideways eight or an infinity sign. Lower body isn't moving, it's staying static. Reaching side to side, shoulders down, your abs are working hard. Five seconds. Four, three, two, and one. Great job. Ready for those gorilla shuffles? Whew. You have five seconds. Four, three, two, take it low. Hand, hand, foot, foot. Hand, hand, foot, foot. Take it back. Again, once you have the exercise, you go a little faster, keeping your arms slightly bent, your knees bent, back and forth. Lots of core work, lots of arm work. Five seconds. Four, three, two, and one, excellent. Grab those weights. Round three, you're gonna make those eights. Three, two, and one. Nice. So my lower body is isolated, taking it a little over to each side, a little bit more. Breathe, squeeze your belly, use your obliques and your shoulders. Breathe it out, keep going. Four, three, two, and one. Excellent. Gorilla shuffles. Breathe, recover. Five more seconds of that. Three, two, take it low. Hand, hand, foot, foot. Take it back. So again, once you have that, you move a little faster. If you're still just kind of working it out, take your time. Increase intensity with increasing speed when you're ready. Five seconds. Four, three, two, one more. And amazing, good job. We're getting there, you guys. Three more rounds. Take it low, keep breathing. Ready, go. Shoulders down, sideways eight. So you wanna kinda keep it in this middle zone, right in front of your shoulders, not going any higher, not going any lower. That static squat is gonna engage your inner thighs, your glutes. Five seconds, four, three, two, one. Excellent. Gorilla shuffles. Breathe. Ready? Take it low. And let's go. Hand, hand, foot, foot. And back. Again. Nice and soft, you shouldn't be clomping. You should be nice and soft, controlling by bending your knees, landing on the balls of your feet, side to side. Five seconds, four, three, two, and one. One more set, and that's it. 
I know you're working hard. I'm working hard, I'm right there with you. We can do this, two seconds. Ready, last time, let's go. Side up, down, up. It's a sideways eight. Just pretend you're tracing it. Pretend there's a pen at the end of your dumbbells and you have a giant piece of paper in front of you. Just make that eight. Keep breathing, shoulders down, use your core, squeeze tight. Four seconds, three, two, one. So good, weights down. This is it, gorilla shuffles. Last exercise, make it good. You ready, take it low, three, two, here we go. Hand, hand, foot, foot, and back. So you shouldn't hear your foot clomping, none of that, nice and soft, nice and graceful. One, two, one, two. Good job. Only five seconds. Four, three, two, and one. Such good work. I know it's tough, but it's 20 minutes. You get it done, you're out. You're burning more calories the rest of the day. Let's stretch a little. Take it down to your knees. Pull one arm in front of you, shoulders down. Go ahead and drop your head towards your hand, your extended hand. Good, and take it to the other side. Shoulder down, you don't want your shoulder hugging up. Drop your head. Good job, interlace your fingers. Push forward, pretend someone's poking you back in the belly so you look like a C. Shoulders down, drop your chin. Tuck your pelvis in, stretching your whole spine. Good, then take it up, reach up and back. Tuck your tailbone down, send your thighs forward. Nice job. Sitting back onto your heels, drop one hand and reach overhead, not in front of you. Keep your chest open, look up. And switch. Nice job. One more breath all the way up. Exhale, shake everything down, relax your arms. Amazing, amazing work. So that's your second workout for your second week. You're doing such a good job. You're halfway through this series. Stick with it. I will see you next week. My name is Julia Bognar. Take care. Hey everyone, welcome back to Jimra. I'm Grace Tamayo and I have an awesome ab routine for you. You don't need any weights. We're just gonna be on our mats. We're gonna warm up first, so let's go ahead and get started. So we're gonna start right here. I just want you to go ahead and do some, some hops right here, some lunge hops. Just get warm, get going. Right here, woohoo! We wanna get everything awake. Wake up, turn it here. There we go. We do some here, boom, boom, boom. All right, let's trot it out. Right here. Kick it up, let's do some butt kicks. Get those quads all stretched out. Just wanna get everything activated, get the blood flowing, things circulating. Go ahead and bring it down. We're gonna come here. We have serving trays and we just go back and forth. Right here, so we're warming up the abs. So now, here's my hips, they're staying stable. Come around and move the abs. So you don't see this, just right here. Here we go. Keep it here. Good job. And now we're gonna go one, two, three, hold. One, two, three, hold. And this is just to get everything right here awake. Two, three, hold. Two, three, hold. And now we're gonna reach and reach. We're just warming up. Finish up our warm up. Right here. Extend. Stretch it out. Toe tap. Reach. Toe tap. Reach. Good job. Okay. Now we're gonna bring it here. Start to get things in motion. Come in here. Good job. So you reach and you go side. It's different than this one. We want to do the side right here. Reach and crunch it. Reach and crunch it. And get things 
ready to go for our mat. And let's do five and four, three, two, one, and let's switch sides right here. Let's go. Reach and crunch. Feel that stretch and then crunch it. Elongate, crunch. This leg is stable. And let's do five, four, three, two, one. One more move before we take it down to the mat. We're getting things going now. We're right here and we go side to side. Good job. I know this one's hard because now we've got our legs working as well, but I know you can do it. Let's get those rock hard abs. <laughs> so, <laughs> We just do our best. Right here, come up if you need to, but just make sure you go back and forth. Touch the elbows to the thighs. Bring it back down. You can go here. Woo. Let's speed it up for five, four, three, two, and one. All right, stretch it out. Bring it down to your mat. Come on down to our forearms. And we're just gonna do a hip twist right here. Keep everything really tight. Focus on your hips only. Just all of that curving and rounding gives you that nice chiseled oblique look right here. Keep your upper body relaxed as much as possible. We're gonna take it for one, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We're gonna hold it right here and pulse. So we just dip and dip right here. I know it kills, but we want to fire those abs. Let's go. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three two, one, switch sides. Let's just rock it out here and hold on this side. Ready, twist it. It's just a little up, a little drop. So you just stay on that side and pulse and breathe. I'm losing my breath right here. So here we are. And five, four, three, two, one. Bring it back, stretch your arms out. Give the arms a little break. We're gonna turn on over. And we're going to go into a hug and then reach out. So you get to love yourself. So you come in and hug and then go out. Hug and out. See, it's fun. Get to hug yourself <laughs> and in. Make sure you stay tight when you go out. Try not to release everything and drop, but keep it real tight, and then come in. You can reach up. You can reach out. You can have your hands here if you need to. And let's do five more. Four, three, two, one. We're gonna burn it out right here, and we just go in and out, burn it. Right here. Breathe. Suck it in. And five, four, three, two, one. Then we come down and we're gonna go from our elbows to our knees. So we're right here and then we tap. So lift and tap. Lift and tap down right here. So raise up, tap down. Don't forget to breathe. And just get that extra lift, that extra crunch when you're tapping. I get to enjoy the sun. Get a little sun kiss on my skin. <laughs> right here. Just a few more. 
breathe and crunch and this last one so there you go okay now we're gonna go ahead and do some toe taps from here you're right here get your feet level and we go back and forth holding it tight right here breathing enjoying the nature the ocean waves crashing against the rocks you could add this ab routine to any one of your other gym row workouts so if you had a booty workout and you could add the quick abs routine just to get a full full dose <laughs> if you're in a hurry just break it down do the first five minutes after your lower body workout you can do that as well let's do five four three two one okay then we're gonna go into bicycles right here don't forget to breathe that's so important especially when we do the crunches you want to exhale and then add an extra crunch in there right here the breathing is so important especially for me with all the talking <laughs> so so right here side side okay we're gonna turn it over again let's do three two one tuck it up roll over so we're gonna come over we're gonna do some side to side toe taps so we go into our forearms again, um, but we're going to be moving our feet in and out. We can hop or you can do one at a time. So I'll show you both ways. We're right here. Your elbows are right under your shoulders, really relaxed. You know, almost pretend, just mentally tie yourself like this is a relaxing position. <laughs> Suck your abs in, huh, and then you can toe tap one at a time right here. We can bring it up too. When you're ready, just make sure those abs are really tight. Make sure your butt's not up too high. If you're down too low, you can put pressure on your back. So we're right here. Now let's go a little bit faster. You can go right here. So depending on where your focus is, if you're really tight, you're going to feel it. And then we can go back here. And if you like, we can do both feet at the same time. So, in, out. I was out, in. <laughs> so, I promise I'm not dyslexic. Okay, so out, in. Super tricky in the sand. <laughs> so, from sand to mat. Five, four, three, two, one. Good job. Bring it back. And then, we're not finished yet. So, we did the forearms and we rotated our hips but now we're gonna come here and you go back and then back so it's kind of reversing the direction of where we're hitting the muscle right here is that little crunch and it feels so good because you get that little comes around your back gets rid of all those little love handles so right here and you can take it slow because I want you to think about it. When you come here, you hold it and you crunch it. Oh, hold it and crunch it. It's almost better than going fast if you're going quickly. You can't focus as much. So we hold it. Let's just do a few more. Hold it tight, tight. And let's end here right there. All right right there come back and we're gonna twist around back to our mat okay so from here i want you to come down onto your back and we start off with a crunch just with our feet on the ground so we'll be right here now this is where you exhale and get that extra crunch when you come to the top all right so here inhale exhale 
Now the key is that to roll your neck forward, you want to lift up. So it's going to be, you're, you're going to feel it if you're really focused on just kind of lifting your chest up. Stay with me. Okay, we take it up. Toes are pointed. Yay for a beautiful day and the beautiful sun. So we crunch again and we're right here. You're wondering what's coming next. Well, you'll see. <laughs> so right here. Inhale. Exhale. Now we go out and then cross. Rotate each leg. The out is when you crunch up and then go down. Okay, then we open our legs, you keep them there. If you need to bend a little bit, totally cool because what I don't want you to do is be working out your abs and your hip flexors and legs are doing all the work. So you could try here. If you modify, more power to you. Okay, so here we go. Good job, bring it in. All right, so we're going to come on up and we're gonna do a good old Russian twist. How are you feeling? Are you doing great? <laughs> good. So the Russian twist, I'm gonna have you keep your feet on the ground because I want you to focus more on your stomach rather than trying to balance and your legs kicking into gear. That's for a different workout routine. So we're gonna stay right here and lean back, find that sweet spot. Find that spot where you're like, oh, I'm feeling it. And we're gonna tap. You really rotate with your upper body right here. Tap and tap. So feet can stay down, they can be right here, whatever's comfortable. Oh, I have a nice breeze hitting my face. I'm lucky. <laughs> so you can just turn on your YouTube, turn on your channel or Jimra's website. You can get us there and we'll bring you the beach. We'll bring that beach weather to you. A few more. Tap down. Let's speed it up a little. Suck it in. That's right. Now it's really important. If you eat, you've got to work out. So that's just how it is. It's a fact. If you eat food, we got to work out. So just work out, get some movement every day. I don't care what it is. Whatever makes you happy, whatever keeps you motivated, just find that. Find that movement that you like. Turn on our videos, check it out and you will see the difference, but it takes a lot of time. So just be patient with yourself. Enjoy the workout. Enjoy your day and then try again tomorrow. All right, let's chill there. Bring it in. Okay, our last move, guys. We just reach up, reach up. So you get a little bit of arms in there. And for me, I'm kind of uphill and on some bumps. So I've got to do some balancing which means that I've got to keep my core really tight. So this is good. Right here, there, and there. Let's do 10, nine, eight, seven, six, 
five, come on, four, three, and I'm proud of you, two, one, woo! Okay, we're gonna bring it back, stretch out that back right here. Yay, the fun part! You guys did it, and don't skip stretching, this is important. Bring one leg down, just enjoy that stretch here and the hip flexors. Let's go ahead and cross over. We did a teeny bitty of arms, so let's just go right here. Open up this inner thigh, and then we'll cross over, because we got all of this worked in here. You can twist your head around, try to keep your shoulders down. Catching our breath now. Yeah, you're awesome, you know it. So, okay, let's bring the other leg in. You can flex your foot if you wanna protect your knee. You can do a little circling. And then we'll cross it over and get the other arm. There we go. Hold here. Good job. Okay, so we're gonna roll it over, rotate the spine, bring our arms out. Oh yeah. Think about how cool you are because you've got the discipline to just do this video. Way to go. Bring it in. Okay, we're gonna grab our feet, grab your ankles, roll it up, and then we're gonna just go over and we're gonna stretch your abs and then You've rocked it. You're nice and tight and ready to go. We're here. Cobra Pros, if you have any back issues, you can just do tiny little, tiny little press up. Keep your abs tight right here. So you're still working a little bit because you have your abs tight so they can stretch and protect your back. If you like, come up right here. Oh, yeah. Come on back. Breathe. Take it all in. And you're set. All right, you guys. Until next time, I'll see you later. Mwah.